Well, we are working on restoring the uh, fox squirrel population that historically occurred here at Sand Hills Research and Education Center. Uh, we've done a lot of work over the past 10 or 15 years to restore longleaf pine forest to this location. Uh, and now we just want to bring back one of the, the members of that wildlife community. So we're working hard to, to get everything together and get the fox squirrels out here. So we're working on this because historically fox squirrels were prevalent in this area. Um, you had ideal habitat for them, uh, but over the past 10 to 15 years there's been a lot of development uh, in this area. A lot of uh, industry has moved here. We've had a lot of commercial spaces go up and then a countless number of residents built immediately around this place. Well, doing that removed a lot of the habitat that the fox squirrels relied on. Uh, so that habitat's become very fragmented and the population just hasn't recovered from that. The question of why we're doing this um, is going to come up quite a bit. And I think from a conservation standpoint, when you have a component of an ecosystem that was normally there and it's gone, and the reason it's gone is because of the habitat quality has gone downhill. And if you're making efforts to improve that quality of that habitat, then reintroducing that species into the ecosystem, that component, is not only warranted, it's desirable. Uh, it leads to diversity, which leads to stability. Fox squirrels generally utilize longleaf pine uh, forest, mature forest. Uh, they prefer longleaf uh, with, a, with an open understory. So historically, longleaf pine forest occurred from Virginia all the way into Texas. Uh, looking at some of the historical figures, they estimated up to what, 90 million acres? Is that right? A lot. Um, the most recent survey suggested that Today, we have about 4 million acres of longleaf pine forest in that same range. So you've had a 96% loss in habitat throughout that range. Uh, and that's the same range that the fox squirrel once occurred in, uh, and a lot of other species like the red cockaded woodpecker, who's not currently doing so well, but a lot of efforts are out there to save that species. Uh, so historically, longleaf pine was a dominant ecosystem in the south that has disappeared uh, through our utilization of lands. So for this project, we're looking at releasing 20 to 30 uh, mature fox squirrels, um, and we hope to do that in November and December of 2016. Uh, the plan is to release mature adults, and hopefully they'll have a successful breeding season here soon, uh, and the population will start to grow.